<laughs> See, this is fun. This is fun. I don't mind getting this wrong. <laughs> Still got a bronze. Hello everybody, welcome to Chaz Draycott Media. Welcome to another episode of Gran Turismo 2, and welcome to another episode where we take on license test. This is episode 101, I can't believe we've got this many done. We're back with the International Sea License though, and this very pesky test in the Alfa Romeo that really hampered me last time. It was one that I did not expect to be difficult at all, so I've just got to jump in and try and give it a go once again. Still using the handy Xbox One Elite 2 controller, lovely bit of kit, I absolutely adore this controller, feels very beefy, hasn't let me down at all. Touch wood. I've been told by somebody in the comments to just check out the demo before I then go and try these tests. To be honest, he's not wrong. <laughs> he, she, they, they're not wrong. Let's go for the, how do you change camera? So where are they? Look, way out wide in the middle of the road there, over to the right, about 74 mile an hour over that curve, really tight in there, all the way over to the right hand side, wow, let's just do that. How did they get it to turn like that? How did they get it to turn like they did there? 20.8, what? <laughs> they got it to turn so well. Hang on, you can see the inputs. You can see the inputs when they do it, so let's try again. Right, around to the right. Breaking straight back on the throttle, all the way around as hard as you can. Right, so you've got to be straight on the throttle. That's a 20.175, I think it says there. Yeah, you've got to get the front to bring the car around. 20.3, not so shabby. Our best is a 189 at the moment. We only need to find a couple of thousands. I promise you though, above everything else, I'm going into this calmly. I've just had a really nice stint on Tower Simulator 3, and now I'm recording Gran Turismo. Because I've got a Friday night where I'm not doing anything, and I'm going away tomorrow, so I need to... Oh God. Use my night to do some recording. Oh wow. Oh <laughs> God. Sorry, Mum. I've let you down. For some reason, I'm counting attempts now. This is attempt number four. Way out wide. Why am I so slow? <laughs> oh, I don't get it. I'm really wide at that left-hander, though, aren't I? And if I remember rightly, all of our records were within the ones. Nearly hit that gantry then. And it's still a 20.8. <laughs> what are you doing, Charles? What are you doing? Oh, dearie me. I don't, <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get it. Watch the demo again. Watch the demo again. Right, they're almost all the way over on the left-hand side of the road, actually, instead of in the middle. Let the car go out to the left. Break in at the first blue bit. Accelerate over that. You've got to be very aggressive on that part. Almost all the way over here. They do not have the car oversteering like I do there. Well, they don't have it understeering anyway. I don't know. Oversteer, understeering. 
doesn't do the same thing as what theirs does. So all the way over to the left. Sort of aim for the white line, but not the curb. Yeah. And we're doing 67 mile an hour there, and they were doing 74 over that curb. Remember that, they were doing 74 over the first curb, and I was doing 67, 68, then 69. So there's something going on that I'm not doing right here, <laughs> clearly. Oh, bloody wall. Just doesn't turn, man. I'm still doing 73 mile an hour, so that's fine, but it just does not turn like they have it turning. 20.3 of 7, that's a bit better. I don't know whether they've got a little bit of um, lock on when they're on the brakes. Like. Yeah, it seems to help actually. Hmm. Maybe not on the exit, it was a little bit shoddy on the exit there. But I think that you might lose a bit of speed if you push it a bit too hard by sliding the car into there, so I think there's a balancing act to it. It's a little bit more incremental with it, but still. I think maybe that might be something to do with it. You know, there was a lot of sort of tap on and off inputs with them and not much sort of holding it down. I do quite a lot of holding it down, so let's just check it again. And watch their inputs, look. Tap, 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 tap. Ready now, look. Not much holding of it. Maybe a bit there and then tap, 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 tap. It's quite a lot of holding actually around that second bit. They crossed the line at 91 miles an hour. So that'll show us whether we're losing speed somewhere. Oh. We crossed it at 90, but that was a much better run. Yeah, it's in our records, okay. I had a little bit of a lift through the left-hander though, and I don't think the demo did. Way too far out wide. Still, it's in the twos. Hmm. Well, we may be onto something here. It's just very difficult to judge that first left-hander. Sorry, my foot's really itchy. Doing my head in. Let's go all the way over. Properly over. Oh, another 251. I held my breath through that. <laughs> I was holding my breath. Okay, we're making a little bit of progress here if we can consistently get some of our records on there. Ooh. Oh, another one. Another one. There's definitely something to do with the tappy tap method, not just on the brakes, but the steering. It's that initial flick of steering, I think, is quite important, clearly. And I'd never really witnessed that with Gran Turismo 2 before, so this is its teaching me something. Oh, it's a tighter line, but it's slower because I think we hit the wall. Yeah, it's a little bit slower, but not much. 20.3 is still decent. It wasn't a record, but it was still decent. Come on. Guide it round. Doing 101 mile an hour consistently around there now. We've got to turn in early here. Oh, 237. <laughs> We're shaving bits off. Come on. You've got to really turn in early, but I think I'm breaking too much. Is it a record? It is. Right, where are our records at right now? Oh, look at that. That was our fifth place record, that one. Come on. You can do this, Chaz. You can do this. We're close. We're close, aren't we? I think, if anything, I'm downshifting too early. I can't remember where they downshifted. I hate the rev limiter and everything there. To be fair, we know we're doing alright when a 20.445 starts to feel really shoddy. I need to save the downshift for a few more meters.
Okay, we're into the ones. We're into the ones. That makes a difference. Ow, I just found a huge spot in the back of my head. Ow. Okie dokie. Come on, can we do it? Can we do it? Yes, we can. Bob the Builder. I can't get demonetized for that, can I? Oh. Straight to the wall, scrubbed off loads of speed. Still a 20.3. Hmm, not enough. I think I could sort of sense a little bit of difference there in holding the throttle down. No, holding the steering down instead of tapping it. I've, it felt like the revs started to climb a little bit more when I was tapping it instead of staying full lock all the time and scrubbing off speed. That's how microscopically accurate this game is. It's hard to do both at once. That felt all right. Oh, that still wasn't. Very wide through there. Twenty point four. I let it run out well too wide. Okay, let's just have a bit of a refresh of this demo. So they're in the shadows on the on the left hand side, not touching the white line. That initial they're accelerating across that curb. They're flat all the way after that, and then a little flick to the left just shortens it slightly. I don't know how you're doing that because look, I'm flat and it's just it's just nothing like what they're doing. I know obviously, you know, theirs is a really good time, but I don't know. Ooh, 20.2. That felt alright, that one. And it's in the record books. Okay. I can take that. I'm happy with if we're just putting records up there, you know. It's one of our five best attempts that we've had. Another 20.2. Okay, so it's not a record anymore at that sort of level. It's way too easy to just downshift as soon as you get on the brakes. And now it results in a 20.4. It's weird how that effect works. Oh, 194, that's only a couple of tenths off our very best time. Okay, I'm happy with that. It's so weird how tapping the steering works so well. It really is. It, it's, it shouldn't be like that. But still, it works. It's just this initial corner here that I can't get right. So, because I'm on the brakes... Oh, is this the one? No! Hit the wall. Oh, man. I was too determined. I don't, you don't want to let go of the steering when you're already full lock, but it's it's, oh, it's what you've got to do. So I'm holding down left all the way, but really you need to be tapping it a little bit more instead of holding it. And it's just none of your brain says come off the steering, Chaz. Like, look, it just suddenly grips up like a second or third time there. Hey, look, look at that, the grip's insane. That was weird. That was a definite example of it, though, because I was flat there when I was before at the same part of the circuit, and we ran wide, so... Let's make it work. The only difficult bit for me is that I'm using my left index finger to change down a gear while braking with my right thumb and steering with my left thumb. Which usually results in that sort of behaviour by the car. The tappy tap method of steering is is incredible. That's been a real eye opener for me. That that last one was a bronze, by the way. <laughs> Whoa, it's a bit aggressive. It's so weird. It's so weird. It's so weird to come off the steering to make it steer more. It was a bit slower because just 
as well as being uncomfortable. I just can't get on with coming off the steering at all. It seems so weird. Oh, I had secret hope there because the first corner felt nice. Now they were straight on the throttle once they got onto that kerb and I think the main thing to think about there is that this is a front wheel drive car so it's going to drag that front end around isn't it? Just apparently not. I would have hated for that to be the run. Oh, it's a bit all over the place there. God's sake. I may as well just finish the run anyway. I feel like my right ear is blocked. I can't really hear out of it very well. It's really annoyed. That wide line didn't help anyone, did it? Nobody at all. <laughs> Just doesn't make any sense at all. <laughs> Come on, we can do this. We've been so close up to now, let's not. I say let's like as if it's you lot losing your head, it's not it's me. You know what's mental about that is that we still passed. Same music again. That felt good. Oh, it wasn't enough. Smoothly does it. I don't know how they did that at all. I do not know how they did that at all. Sod off, I don't care. My ear is doing my head in, man. Hang on. Sorry about that. Oh no, I put my controller down and it's kicked off. It'd be funny if I did this first time now, wouldn't it? I think we just had proof there that that gripping tactic works because that was running well wide and I was tapping the steering then. Watch my inputs. Tap, 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 tap. All the way around. And brake. Look, tap, 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 tap. And it grips more than if I just hold on to it. And we got a 20.2. We were five hundredths off because of that. It's weird, man. That was a lot slower because I just went way too slow through the first corner. <laughs> oh, what's it doing there? Whoa, it didn't want to play ball there at all. Oh, I turned in too early. Oh, rage quit. <laughs> Sorry. Typically, following a rage quit, we now get metal music. <laughs> Ooh, that looked similar to the, uh, <laughs> no, it didn't look similar to the demo chat, shut up. Did they throw it in on the brakes? I can't remember. It's just, I can't get the car to turn in there where they did. Like, it does not turn the same for me as it did for them. 20.316, it's just not good enough. I'm going to watch it again. They were breaking for quite a while, to be fair. But you just got to turn in super early. <laughs> oh, 
I don't know. I'm going to do some attempts without talking now. I'm just going to try. I might cut out a lot of time here. Oh, I've not put the thing in the top left of the screen. Oh, I've not done it. Hang on. So now you can see that I'm doing this at quarter past ten at night. <laughs> uh. I said I was going to do a bunch of them without talking as well. If I could do one without hitting the wall, it'd be nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> So confident that was the one with that slide then. Sorry. Like there, like how are they tucked in on that curb? The second curb when they're on the throttle as early as they are. I don't get that at all. Maybe something like that. No, we just lost the speed, that's what I mean. So they're sliding like mad. I say like mad, they're sliding a bit to get that oversteer and they're not losing the speed through it. Maybe we've got to try and oversteer the car a little bit more. Back into the twos, but still it's not. I'm really... <laughs> getting defeated by this one. Oh, that's the best we've done. That is the best we've done, and we are 26 thousandths of a second off. Right, let's see what we did. Wasn't as far over as them. A bit of a lift mid-corner, but tucking it in... I oh, wasn't even that tucked in there, either. I think carrying the speed on the way out was very important, and then... Figure it out when we get to the wall. That's the best time we've done. Come on, we're so close. Back to reality. <laughs> Oh, I've lost a mile an hour or two there. Just, it must behave itself. Big red bag of Hang on, was that a 226? How was that a 226? And that was 272, and that was like, really, oh, oh dearie, me Gran Turismo. Just seems very inconsistent with method versus reward. That was really good. Yes! Come on! Whoo! We got there, everybody. We got there. Jesus Christ! I hate that f***ing car. I hate that f***ing track. It can f*** off. One more test away from completely golding the IC license. Corvette Grand Sport at Seattle. This is going to be painful, isn't it? Because I thought, you know, an Alpha around a couple of corners at Rome wasn't bad. See what we can do. This is the final one. Let's not forget, 
our garage isn't full anymore. So... Suddenly prod. Right, where are we going? Okay, I know this bit. This feels good, this car. Oh, that was... That felt well nice. Go on. Oh. 22.9. That felt great. Okay. <laughs> Suddenly happy now. <laughs> I hate the Grand Sport, but still, I think that was... That's good fun, that bit. Come on. Come on. We can do this. Oh, I oversteer. Understeer. Oh dear. Whoops. Whoa. Well, that big slide isn't going to help, is it? An unruly car, this may be. Come on, Corvette. Why did you have to swing out like that, you pig? That was tidy, though. It wasn't flamboyant and mental like it usually is, but it was just slower in general, wasn't it? Still, it's on the record board. Then again, we've only done, like, five attempts. So, tappy tap brake method keeps the car nice and stable ish. Oh god. <laughs> that slide was cool. At least this car's f***ing fun, unlike your the Alfa Romeo. Don't mind driving this around this bit, this is fun. Speed difference. Oh, Chaz, you cretin. You had a really good first corner there. Just drifted, said it. <laughs> See, this is fun. This is fun. I don't mind getting this wrong. <laughs> Still got a bronze. We're so close to getting full gold IC license. Oh, that was close. Oh, that felt quick. That felt really quick. That felt really quick. Yes! Come on! There goes the IC license, everybody. Full gold all the way through. We've done it. Oh, that was nowhere near as difficult as the Alfa Romeo and a Corvette Grand Sport around Seattle should be. Oh, look how Larry this was. It's high speed, there's really narrow confines, there's walls either side of you, but it's just, look at the thing go, look at that, two wheels into a barrier, hard on the brakes, kicking the back end out, trying to straighten it up, brilliant, that's a laugh, that's what it's all about. And we've got all gold now in the International C license, and we've got a new car, let's save the game and we'll go and see what said car is, shall we? Come to think of it, while I'm here, did we get a reward for our A class? What's one that we can do easily? So we completed it when our garage was full, basically. So I don't think we get whatever reward car there was. If there is one, let me Google it. It's all right. It's only a Dodge concept car. However, I've also seen what we've just won for doing this. Get that mouse off the screen. Ready? Yes. <laughs> yes. All of the yes. And I prefer it in silver to gold. I prefer it in this sort of weird bluey, grey, silver. Not sure about you. I like the blinking rally art stickers. They're cool. That's fantastic. We've done the International Sea License. 
B and A to go. I don't think you can get golds in the whatever it is, the super license thing at the end. But boy, that was a roller coaster of emotions in itself. Um, ugh, I need to lie down. Thank you very much for watching, though. Really hope you're enjoying these. We finally got through that license, and we will go through IB as well. We're over 100 episodes into this playthrough now, and I still love every minute of it. I know I tear my hair out over some of them, and I'm not putting in as much effort as to, well, into editing as I was earlier on. It doesn't get the viewership as much, but I know that in time, people will want to go through this playlist and see it. And I think that uh, it's, it's, I hope that I'm reflecting the amount of fun that I'm having because I really do enjoy this. Anyway, thank you once again for watching. Really hope you've enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next episode.